Sir, get down! Sir, get down! Hey! Hey! To the window! <laughs> and that was the last of the research for this video. While it kicks in, let me spin you a tale, my good pimp. It's Saturday at 12 a.m., a promising new day, and you're out there bouncing in the club to dodging cars or I spy or skibbity toilet, whatever devil music the youth bounces to. The point is, you're dancing like Al Pacino and Scarface just busting it down, turning that rave into a ravenous monsoon, you with me? But you want to turn up the energy. You want to turn on that gas oven and make some s'mores. Maybe you want to make some YouTube videos. So you have two options. Option number one, Ministry of Love is my witness, I do not condone it. The white snow, the devil's dick cheese, the Yeti's dandruff, the Yeti's Parmesan sprinkles, book of sugar. That's short layover in Lockjaw City, all for a brief moment of war so back. All before a heavy come down to it's all Jover. A temporary shortcut to feeling like you're the king shit before you shortcut through a family of four on your way home. And that's where option two comes in. Officer Fleek says say no to drugs and say yes to flexible suggestions of engagement policies. What exactly is your child carrying in addition to a book? Something simple as a crack pipe. Ron takes place in totally not Hollywood, which explains why half the maps are you dropping list toppers. Now, in concept, it's a SWAT 5 simulator where you play as an armed observer saving civvies and dropping baddies, but only if they get antsy first. However, in reality, you know, the real world where there's real dolphins and shit, it's you getting hip fire headshot by a furry's 20 man security detail. It's you going, oh, let me use the stairs. It's the same. And I'm dead because this fuck was born out of the great darkness with the sole mission to shoot me in the cock. But even when they surrender and I try to be all judicial about it, they change nationalities on me. Even Stacy shivin' me, acting like I don't believe in equality. These AI are so committed to the bit that they will get killed so that they can come back to life and not surrender for a second time. Whereas the Lord's powder can make the snake recoil, you know, the flag go to half mast, cook the spaghetti noodles, so to speak. Ready or not's gonna keep your rock hard because these AI are constantly fucking you. I waited a year for this update only to die to the same broken AI with a new gun in my hands on different soil. But here's the thing, fighting these spastic sons of bitches is the high. I live to kick open that door and draw down like it's a scene straight out of Justified. To lock eyes with a perp on perks then persecute them with my big iron. And the more wiry the beast, the bigger the rush I get from it. One better and more frequent than headbutting Tony Montana's desk. Have you heard the scientists say how Ready or Not's gunfights have so much tense buildup and bombastic payoff that it actually mirrors the dopamine release that our ancestors got from hunting, almost like we're tricking our biology into giving us a fix that's actually higher than that of Colombian table salt? Because I have not. I'm just saying it's possible. You should look for it. You should look it up. If nothing else, the fix is much cheaper. Booger sugar is gonna burn a hole in your septum and make you a real yapaholic. Get you talking to everybody in the club about your plans to make a water park without the water. I mean, still not as bad as what the blue stuff did. I mean... That created the Volkswagen. I mean, at worst, ready or not, I'll have you staring blankly out of the window thinking about how, you know, it, sh it should have been me that walked through the door that day. You know, how, how Gibby had two years left on the force. You know, he never made it home to, to, to kiss the dog and play with the wife. Because of me. Rest in peace, Gibby. If Pablo was still here, he could have sold Ready or Not to all the Florida men completely legally. A high without the time. Pimp, what I'm trying to say is this. Don't buy this game for a realistic police sim. Buy this game as a police-themed version of Doom, where instead of killing sinners in hell, you send sinners to hell. I do believe it was Austin 316 that said, 24 mags should be enough to maintain the peace. <laughs> We don't negotiate with terrorists. Oh, I bet you thought you were done with me, motherfucker! But Blake Coffee's wife cheated on him with the chef and now she's leaving me. So this is a new show to pay my alimony called Lying Bitches. For the last two years, Fleek Harvey has enjoyed torturing Milsim loppers by going into public lobbies with AI mods that turn everyone into Navy SEALs and British people. But now that the regular AI has become almost as bad as my mods, you have to guess whether the clip you see is modded or unmodded. Here we go. I'll zip it up. Jeff, what do you think? And work dick somewhere into your answer. Why dick, fool? Oh my god, can't you see? You can just see the kids. The FTC has my family a hostage. They have shot my dog. Your wife is in the audience tonight. I hope you lose it all, Hefe. Just like I did. <laughs>
Unmodded, folks. Lion bitches will be right back after these messages. And before you tell me, oh, Officer Fleek, what about ROE? I don't know. What about ROE, Void? Being a SWAT officer, one acronym you'll hear very often is ROE. This means Rules of Engagement. Now, there's a whole lot of them. Too many, if you ask me. But basically, don't shoot unless shot or definitively about to be shot. Violate this rule, buddy, and your wrist will be thoroughly slapped. But in Ready or Not, there is only one rule of engagement you need to know, and that is Engage. I will personally gift you a shake weight and a crisp high five if you can catch an unauthorized use of lethal force charge because these tweakers crave the great beyond. I mean, just look at these savages. Do you see them checking to see if you're one of their teammates before they start firing? Do you see them gabbing you up to see if you're one of the good ones? Because I'll tell you what I see. I see a motherfucker shooting at me from the poolside as he gets his bronze on. I see a fella coming out of the closet to give me back shots and it ain't even June yet. Whatever J.O. crystals these AI are on has them shooting through three walls if they even feel your aura in the building. And if you ask me, that sounds like a violation of rule number two, and that is why you will almost never catch a case. The fact that I still do is a testament to my talent as an officer. What should scare you is that I still rarely get these. Hesitation is defeat. But by all means, have at it, Liam Neeson. See if you can piss him into submission. No justice, no piss, brother. Be well. I'll be in the other room giving this one a goddamn 45 caliber exorcism. My mind telling me no. I believe in this so much that I even made my non-lethal shotgun lethal. Wake up before you get put to sleep. Besides, I ran some more scientific tests. And as it would turn out, you can go full body cams off and still unlock the next level. You, it, the grade means nothing. A unless you want to unlock the Hawaiian shirts that you can flex on your enemies. Oh, don't shoot the messenger. Y you wouldn't want to violate ROE, would you? What if the messenger shoots you? That's my point. That's all I'm trying to tell you, pimp. I just care about you. We are back with lying bitches, this time with a new clip. Let's roll it. What the fuck is going on? This is the one you just grabbed off the dream and was dragged. 28 stab wounds. Rudy, you're up. Nah, I think that's modded footage, Fleek. Oh my god, Rudy. Lord, Rudy, Jesus fucking Christ, Rudy. I'm gonna crucify you and make a new religion all around you, Rudy. Rudy, is that your son in the audience there? Little Rudy. Tell me something. Why is your father such a failure? <laughs> I know this isn't on the board. <laughs> All that being said, how does the lead slinging feel, you ask? Every bullet is like a happy ending. The sparks, the blood, the bullet holes, the puffs of smoke out of the gun, the loud crackling shots, the heavy recoil, <gasps> paired with the screen shake and the blurring if you're getting shot right back, and that beautiful premature e jack tech e back flick of the mag at the wall. Not to mention the crisp, infatuating leaning functionalities paired with an <laughs> even yeah, deeper <laughs> stationary <laughs> lean. All this power is intoxicating. And it's galaxies better than the electric inability to aim gunplay a SWAT for. Now, the rush of all these guns blazing encounters does come with side effects, most namely paranoia. When you're so amped up shuffling through empty hallways, knowing these enlightened AI could be around any corner ready to drop you, it tends to keep you a bit on the edge. Maybe you do an oopsie, maybe you do a little blue on blue oopsie, but if you ever shoot your own, just give them the old. Sorry friendly, about that. friendly. Uh, just testing out your body armor. It's good. Fully intact. Who knows? I don't know. Are you a perp? Am I? All I know is... Lion Bitches is back, and I've just gotten word that our show has already been cancelled by the network. That's alright. Just 20 years of loyalty down the drain. Is that on the board? <laughs> Seems to be the trend lately. Anyways, what's your name, fuckface? Watch this. M Mr. Fleek Harvey, that's just a picture of your dick, man. That's right, unmodded, folks. Can you believe it? Just like this gun. I've had enough. I'm fed up. We'll be right back with Fleek Harvey's ransom demand. Now, although I love hanging with the mind magnets, at some point, a regular hit of Ron is just not gonna do it for you anymore. It's like coffee. Remember when one cup of coffee was enough? Now look at yourself. You're doing rails of coffee grounds off of the barista's barestuses as you wait on a coffee with ten shots of espresso and two shots of the diabetes in it just so you can get half hard by noon. Me, I stay hard, motherfucker, and you best believe it. And that's because I flipped on mods a hundred hours ago and I never looked back. A flood of Among Us men and British people. It's almost like we haven't cleared the top four. An onslaught of AI that cha-cha slides through the biggest milsim law
Hey, hey. I just want to let you know. Oh shit. M249 is spanning entire maps. Nine bangers, pro bangers. <laughs> what the fuck? Increasing suspect counts to the max. Increasing team count to 13. <laughs> Looks like they're giving oral. God, God damn it. Damn it. I unleash them upon every public lobby I'm in. Call me Don Pablo because I'm giving everyone the fix. Is it a mod? Is it, is it a zombie mod or something? It's a zombie. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, probably not. I don't know, man. Is no, it? no, no, no. It's just an all natural, regular experience. <laughs> No and it's not malicious or nothing, it's just... Oh, oh, oh. In the end, I, all I ever wanted was for everyone to see the world... ...through my eyes. As far as maps go, Neon Tomb clears. The color schemes, the neons, the tombs, the the tombs, the the, the neons, the railings, the, the, the tombs. Bring back the hotel map void. Bring back the good farm map void. Bring back the mode selected map variations void. Give me an LMG void. Bring back the carpet so that I got a tarred wrangle 16 motherfuckers onto that mat so I can get the mission started void. That's it. Welcome back one last time to Fleek Harvey's Ransom Demand. Brought to you in part by Manscaped. Gotta keep it looking like my head down there. I'm a helicopter and a cheeseburger and a oh so it's like that then survey says i'm easy to find wrong answer wrong answer ah. Ah. You fan of the feud. This is Bravo 4, I got him. Nah, man, I, I hate those cheesy ass game shows, man. I guess that was the fast money challenge all along. Drop the weapon! Drop the weapon! We surveyed one fleek hobby asking them if they sent enough men. Survey says, you're a hundred short, bitch. See ya! Thanks to the flock of pimps for bankroll in this video, and another massive thanks to all the pimperers for funding all the research. I am back from the Balkans, and therefore regular sermons will recommence. See you later. He who shoots with his hand has forgotten the face of his father. I shoot with my mind. I did not aim with my hand. He who aims with his hand has forgotten the face of his father. I aim with my mind.